Okay, this is the SG90 servo motor. We will try to convert this servo motor into a DC motor. So we can get a DC motor with high torque and of course cheap. We need to open the case by loose the two bolts using the screwdriver. After the case is open, we will looking for a limiter. In standard servo motor, there is a limiter, so the motor cannot rotate more than 180 degree, and the limiter is on top of the gear, and that's right there on the top. Of a gear, then we will find the limiter. But first, we will open the top case and then pull out the gear. After that, we will find the limiter. Okay, so this is the top here and there is the limiter okay you can see that the limiter so the motor cannot rotate more than 180 degrees because of this limiter now I will try to cut this limiter using a cutter now the gear is clean from the limiter now we will put back the gear to the servo after we put back the gear to the servo we will now have to close the top case Okay, after we put back the gear into the position, now we time to bypass the electronics. So the servo will not function as servo anymore and let's only function as DC motor. So we will just remove the yellow wire so it now only have two wire. We will bypass the electronics by soldering the two wires directly to the DC.
bellissimo Now I will solder the two wire to the motors directly it's on the bottom of the motor wait before we continue the video please subscribe and ring the bell to make us more enthusiastic and energized to make another video Okay, after the soldering is done, now I will put back the bottom case so that the servo will back to its case. And now we have the DC motor, not the servo anymore. Okay, now it's done, it's time to test our DC motor, our high torque DC motor. So I will just connect the DC motor to 5 volt power supply. The 5 volt power supply I got from Arduino. Okay, and now it's look smooth. The 5 volt DC motor looks smooth, and of course, we have the high torque DC motor. Thank you for watching, and see you in another tutorial. Bye!